rotoscoping. What does it do? What does it even mean? Now, two things that come to mind. It's a telescope. Or, it's a term for the rotisserie chicken making machines. Yeah, but you're wrong. Rotoscoping. It is the act of taking something like a clip from a TV show, maybe a video you watched, cutting an item or person out of that video to place it in another area where it's technically not supposed to be. I'm sure you're confused, so let's get on with it. I'm gonna show you. Two things you're gonna need, Premiere Pro and After Effects. All you're gonna wanna do is click New Project. It's gonna pop up this little tab, call it whatever. I'm gonna call it Bob Logie. I don't know, it's just a creative choice. Don't question. You're also gonna need After Effects open. So we're probably gonna cut it from, from Hello. here. We're gonna start there. We're gonna pop that. That I love. I absolutely love. And you can fine tune it by using your arrow keys. We're just gonna cut it off there. Use that. What you're gonna wanna do is to get your clip a little bit easier to work with in After Effects. You're gonna wanna find this right here, scene edit detection. You're gonna wanna clip, click that, go on, and it'll automatically cut up your clip to make it easier to work with. So now what you're going to want to do is now that you have After Effects open and everything, you're going to want to find the replace with After Effects composition. Click on that, of course, and it's going to open up in After Effects. You can name the project uh, Bob Lerp. Don't ask. Creative choice. Uh, you're going to want to double click on your top clip. Or sometimes it has a stroke, so just do that. And that's going to make it a layer. And then you're going to want to go over here. This is the roto brush. And now you are rotoscoping. So a couple things I think you should know first. Control click makes your brush bigger or smaller depending on how you drag it. Alt, that'll make the delete. So let's just say I, I capture Frank Reynolds here and I no longer want him. Gone. Now that we got that out of the way, you can now start on your rotoscoping process. Make sure you have the first clip selected. And all you want to do is just color in your person or item you are selecting. If you need to, you can zoom in and use your middle mouse button to move around just to get everything as good as you possibly can. Now that we have both of our subjects, if you press play, it should hopefully do its job and not get off course. All right, and now that we have our first clip done, all you have to do is the... Uh, the rest of these, which is definitely going to take a little bit of time on my part. Okay, and after you get all the clips done, you're going to be left with a little something like this. Now all you want to do is just go right back over to Premiere Pro. You're going to want to drag this up one, hit this, and hit Color Matte. You're going to click OK. You're going to hit green like that. Okay, just call it that. Right under here. And then now you have a green screen. Now all you're going to want to do is just hit File, Export, Media. Now all you gotta do is just hit export and it'll export the thing. Okay, and after that's exported, go to your export folder, grab the clip. So now what you wanna do is you just wanna delete this. You don't need it anymore. Now you're gonna wanna drag this up one cause of the footage you're gonna wanna throw underneath. You can throw whatever you want underneath. It doesn't have to be specific to anything, just whatever you want. Find Alter Key, you can either search for it manually or just go Ultra, Alter Key. You're gonna wanna drag that on there and take the color key and do that so now it's green screened. Go back to your project and probably do that. I'm gonna end up taking the audio off anyways, just because I don't need it. Now that you have that, you can now uh, find clips from what you've recorded. You know what? It's not the most perfect job, but you know what? It does pretty good. It looks decent anyways uh but yeah no guys uh that is how you rotoscope thank you for watching bullshit bullshit derivative that i love i absolutely love